The patient we will take today is a 61-year-old male patient with a bladder tumor plus a tumor in the colon. Of course, the interesting thing about this case was that although there were no symptoms, the process started when a bladder mass was seen on ultrasound during the general health check. Later, when detailed examinations were made, it was seen that there was also a colon tumor at the level of 70 centimeters in the colon. Of course, our patient is actually an interesting case that shows how important a general health check is. It is one of the important indicators of the importance of annual health checks that we recommend to all our patients after the age of 40. Here, of course, I want to talk a little bit about general health check because why is it important? Now, due to the advancing average age, the increase in environmental factors, and the effect of personal factors, several disease groups are very common. One of them is heart disease. They can occur at a very early age, and you can reduce the risk of preventive and future heart diseases only if early diagnosis and necessary precautions are taken. Second, especially cancers. Today, we all know very well that early diagnosis is still the most important criterion for almost all cancers. Therefore, the way to make an early diagnosis is to undergo a general control. As in our patient, the general controls had no symptoms, neither bleeding in the urine nor a problem with defecation. A suspicious lesion was seen in the bladder during the general health checks. On top of this suspicious lesion, first ultrasonography and then tomography, I saw suspicious areas in the rectum and colon. Therefore, rectoscopy was performed and when it was performed together with colonoscopy, villous adenomas in the rectum and a tumor in the colon were detected. The biopsy also revealed that there were two tumors at the same time. One of them is a bladder tumor and the other is a colon tumor. First of all, the surgery we will perform today is transurethral bladder tumor resection and it will be performed by the urologist, that is, me. Afterwards, general surgery will perform laparoscopic hemicolectomy surgery. This is our planned treatment. Of course, everything will become clearer after pathology, but when we look at their current images, there are findings that we can call early diagnosis for both diseases. The surgery we are doing now, there is a mass of about 4 centimeters on the right side of the bladder. I perform TUR bladder tumor resection with plasma kinetics for this mass. The mass we see now has grown vegetatively into the bladder, but the disease also exists elsewhere, of course. It has grown and the mass is seen in several solid foci. The mass is larger than we expected. It is also seen very clearly in the image. Of course, it is interesting that the disease does not cause any symptoms, especially clotted bleeding in the urine which we observed in previous cases. Usually, the first symptoms of bladder tumors are manifested by bleeding. In the bladder, the tumor is seen not only as one focus, but multiple foci. Of course, this is an undesired scene, not a view we like very much. But of course, we will see in more detail after the pathological examination. Our patient surgery is now completed. New bladder tumor areas were detected in the trigon region on the right wall of the bladder, and in the area near the 12 o'clock position on the left side of the bladder neck, and all of them underwent TUR tumor resection. Our surgery is now over. We are waiting for the pathology results, we will discuss a second treatment according to the pathology result.